Hello, we're going to have a look at C major scale today. A C major scale uses only white notes and it will generally go from one C to another C. So our right hand is going to start on the middle C with the thumb and it's going to look like this. Now the key points were after the E, after the third note, when our thumb had to creep under the hand to reach the F so that we then had enough fingers left over to reach this next higher C. And then on the way back down, after we played the F with the thumb, the third finger had to go over the thumb so that we had the three fingers there left to come back down. Now when your left hand plays the scale, it will probably start on this lower C. And it will do a similar thing, but it will use all the five fingers first and then come over to the A with the three. And then it will go back down and creep under to the G with your thumb. And then you'll have enough fingers left to get back down again. So that left hand on its own once more. these hands together there's two ways to do it the first is what we call contrary motion so that's where the hands go opposite directions to each other contrary contrary motion so they will both start on the middle C and we do it in contrary motion and it will look like this so they will both go under the hand at the same point as each other, and they will both go over at the same point as each other in contrary motion. Under. Over. Try that a few times, and when you feel you've mastered it, you could then try parallel motion. This is a little bit more tricky. Parallel motion, where they go the same direction at the same time means that the hands are going under or over at slightly different times. So I'll break that down and explain it a little bit more this time. Right hand under, left hand over, left hand under, right hand over. It's more and more fluently, which is what we're aiming for, very smooth sound. 